Hi, I'm Randy Meester. I'm a relay technician out of the Wilton Outpost for SIPCO. A relay technician is in charge of testing and commissioning of the equipment inside of the substation so that the breakers operate when there is a fault at the proper time. Well, I would say um, probably 75% of my time is spent in the field. It may be sitting in the field at a computer troubleshooting, but most of my time is spent in the field. I am uh, checking that the trip circuits and the relay all operate as they should with the specs or the settings that the engineering department supplies. You're trying to make sure that everything operates as it's supposed to so that hopefully if it's just a bird or a shot of lightning, everything recloses and nobody's without power but for a blink. And if it's a big storm, hopefully it isolates and maybe you only have a sub or two subs off and not a whole transmission sub out of service. There's a lot of technology involved with what we do. You have your computer, your iPad, your test set, and it all has to talk together. I started my career as a, a lineman for a municipal, and I come down here as a substation tech, and then I moved into the relay position. Electrically, I went to line school, but as far as the relays and I, I've learned that all on job. A lot of your education, you'll learn more in the field than you will sitting in a classroom. Some computer programming to a certain extent is involved, or a little bit of knowledge of how it works. I enjoy the troubleshooting, trying to figure out why something isn't working, trying to figure out how everything works. It's been a good place um, to work. There's chances for advancement in lots of different ways. In the electrical utility industry, there's quite a few opportunities of different employment. I mean, we have, at the cooperative, we have accountants to engineers to linemen to substation to SCADA techs that all kind of work together to put one thing forth. First would be the membership trying to make sure they get a good product. The member consumers at the end of the line will have service. They feel that they have a good reliability and makes their life better. There's definitely a culture that the members, you have to care about the member, take care of the member, um, respect the member's property. There's accomplishment of working with people from not only SIPCO but other cooperatives.